Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. Late last night, about 9.15 Pacific Standard Time, there was a 4.3 earthquake near Ridgecrest, California. 286 people reported feeling this earthquake. Using Google Earth, this is the location of that earthquake. It's within the area of uplift that was recorded when they had the magnitude 7.1 on July 6th of last year and they went out and they measured how the ground had uplifted and the red lines posted here is you know the the uplift that had occurred and this 4.3 is within the area of uplift there's the location of Ridgecrest now um, these earthquakes have been happening along what's called the Walker Lane Rift System it's a relatively new rift system and if it ever decides to uh, uh, fully mature with a major earthquake, yeah, we're going to be in big trouble. It goes all the way down to the border of uh, California, Mexico, and all the way up towards uh, Oregon, uh, near the Cape Mendocino Triple Junction and the San Andreas Fault Zone. This earthquake was reported to be a fe felt as far as Las Vegas. You can see the different responses and also as far south as Los Angeles, um, Santa Ana, and the uh, San Diego area. Long Beach, Santa Cruz. Um, you can see the different areas here. Thousand Oaks, yeah, Bakersfield, etc. By the moment tensor ball you can see that the fault line lifted up and moved towards the west yeah tension was applied going um, east the initial uh, pressure the first wave of the earthquake came from the southwest according to usgs it was 3.6 kilometers in depth which is about 2.2 uh, miles in depth and i also want to add that the earthquakes that have been occurring in nevada which you can see let me zoom in a little bit ah it's moving slow so when i zoom in it just doesn't do it right anyways up over here uh, mina nevada um the most recent well we got what's this large one right here 2.2 uh, those are also associated with the walker lane rift system in the last seven days, there's been 751 earthquakes in this area. 27, 27 of those earthquakes were larger than a magnitude 2.5. On the 4th, in this same location, there was a magnitude 5.5. And that was the largest that has occurred within the last week. There was also a 4.2. That was on the 4th and we got a 3.5 which also occurred on the fourth and then today's 4.3 these earthquakes are not far from the garlock fault zone and of course that locked zone of the san andreas fault where pressure where pressure has been building so we need to keep an eye on this if you uh, felt this earthquake how long did it last what did it sound like um, what direction did it come from? Did you have any damage? Um, yeah, there could have been some light things that were knocked off shelves and walls. Please put your comments down below. Thank you for subscribing. Please stay safe, and I'll talk to you later. God bless y'all. Bye.